So we've been talking about macroevolution, or the concept of creating new species from species that exist before. We also talked about how isolation is crucial for this process to take place over long periods of time, or even fast into something that we call punctuated equilibrium. But whichever way you look at it, speciation is a process of change in a species, usually because of eventually development of a reproductive barrier. Now this could happen in two main different ways. You could have allopatric speciation or sympatric speciation. Allopatric speciation occurs when there's actual separation between the two uh, species leading to differentiation between them. And sympatric speciation occurs when there's no physical separation but other kinds of reproductive barriers exist which will differentiate between the two species. So let's talk about how each one of these works and then some other kinds of speciation and then how it all gets put together to create different species. So here you see again the concepts of allopatric and sympatric speciation. Can you tell which one is which? We just talked about it. So before you get there, let's go do some Latin. Allopatric, the word allo. Have you heard this little um, root here somewhere, this prefix? Well, you should. In, in biology, we already learned something that's very similar to this. You have alleles or alleles, whichever one you want to say it. But what was that? Those were different versions of the same kind of gene. So see, alleles here means different. So this word allel means different. So that's exactly what allo means. It means different. What about Patrick? What about the word Patrick? You know, have you heard of this, this little uh, root somewhere? Patch, Patrick? All right, well, have you heard of the root patriotic? So patria. This patriotic means to be, have love for your country. So what do you think Patrick means? Well, it actually means country. So allo Patrick, what does that mean? Different country. So allopatric speciation has to do with being different locations, to be physically separated from each other. What about sympatric? Have you heard this word, sim, somewhere? Well, you should. In biology, there's several examples. You have symbiosis. You have synergy. You have symmetry. You have um, synthesis. All of these sims stand for what? Together. So this idea of sympatric speciation means together in the same place but parallel to each other so that's what speciation is so this will be sympatric speciation because they're not separated physically and this will be allopatric speciation because they are separated physically so you see the difference but this is going to be a little more complicated to understand but this one will be pretty easy so this one would be actual habitat separation and this one will be some other kind of separation like behavioral or mechanical or any kind of other separation which will reduce the chances of the of the two species to become part of the same species. And we'll learn about how that actually works in a second.